Hello everybody, this is a Simkin from TGN. This is a first look and a walkthrough of Drake's Fortune 3, Drake's Deception, Chapter 1, Another Round. This gameplay is from the Simkin and Batgirl playing Drake's Fortune single player campaign mode. We are taking turns and handing off the control every 15 minutes or so. Subscribe now to be notified of new Drake's Fortune videos as I complete them. While not strictly a platformer, Drake's Fortune has a Tomb Raider element to it. That definitely includes platformer gameplay. Although unlike most platformers, this one is rather violent and contains many FPS elements and even includes a multiplayer online arena mode. The gameplay essentially starts in a greasy looking bar without any weapons. The first few battles are very easy. For those of you not familiar with the Drake's Fortune series, this here is Sully, short for Sullivan. He helps with most battles and fights through the game, sometimes giving you fire cover and otherwise helping out. This first battle is essentially just punching and countering. There are a few objects throughout the, the scene that you can use to pick up and hit people with. Other than that, there's not much to really say about this battle. It's, it's very, very easy. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Oh yeah. <coughs> there was a, a proper counter and an attack, and there's another one. Oh. This game is just awesome to watch and play. Now this is your first mini boss I suppose. He's not too tough, uh, but he's nearly indestructible. Uh, I was supposed to hit him here with the chair, but I missed the cue. And so I got my ass handed to me. And this is essentially where chapter one starts, I suppose. Uh, I guess before that, we were at the intro. Now you notice that Nate can take a lot of damage and keep going. He's essentially Wolverine in that he can take piles of damage and as long as he doesn't take damage for a few seconds, he can start to recuperate very quickly. It's a little bit ridiculous near the end of the game with the gunfire and shots he can take and just keep going. But it is a game and that's what makes it fun. Oh yeah. This got out of hand in a hurry. Now that's gotta really hurt. Oh, this part just grosses me right out when I see this. Makes me actually want to vomit. Come on. Now if you don't actually attack here, you will get hit before you get a chance to attack, so don't take too long. Whenever you're caught like that, pumping O as fast as you can gets you out as quickly as possible. Oh. Just disgusting. I wouldn't want to go to the washroom in this toilet, let alone have my head shoved in it. And now that's going to cost him a few teeth. And this pretty much wraps up the first chapter. There's just one last small battle here in the kitchen. They're going to need a plunger. Come on. Let's go, Nate. Yeah. And the old geezer at Sullivan. In case you're wondering who they're talking about. Oh, that's really got to hurt. And then you jump out, there's some some chitter-chatter, and then you get shot in the stomach. And on to chapter 2. 